Welcome back, Conius here. Today I'm flying from Iowa City, Iowa to Des Moines, Iowa. I'm flying a Beechcraft 350i King Air. I'm going to set a flight level at 4,000 feet. Let's go ahead and set that flight level now. There's 4,000. And let's go ahead and get started. Take off the parking brake. Stays on the runway. Landing gear up. Flaps up. Start turning into the heading. Type Beechcraft King Air 1 miles west of Kilo India Oscar Whiskey 1000 feet. Request flight following. K 449 approach. Squawk 5327. Squawk 5327 KA 449. KA 449 radar contact 2 miles west of Kilo India Oscar Whiskey 2100 feet. Altimeter tree, zero decimal two three. Roger KA four four nine. Okay, I've been climbing quite a bit. I'm going to go ahead and level off a bit and gain some speed. wants to push up. Looks like we're doing good on all the engine dials. I'm normally concerned about these gauges over here. Engage autopilot, navigation, altitude, hands off the yoke or the stick, and then let's turn on the yaw damp. Alright, so the plane's under automated control, obviously. Go ahead and go outside, reset the view, and look around from out here. Kind of a mixed day, not a bright sunny day, unfortunately. It's kind of an interesting perspective, the plane right at the horizon.
Alright, well, nice smooth flight so far. Co-pilot's taking care of radio communications. Let's go inside for a minute. Go to the heads-up view here. Let's see if I can back up. I kind of like this view. Not really a lot to see. I had this crazy idea to take a picture of what I'm staring at right now. Just so you can see what it looks like when I'm making one of these recordings. Alright, take a couple shots. Go back outside. And look around a little bit. Very flat, a lot of agricultural, this is what you'd expect in this area again, Iowa. Just imagine a lot of wheat growing, stuff like that. Really amazing how realistic it looks. Kind of feels like it. to Des Moines. Not a whole lot to do at this point, except make sure everything remains stable. Let's see what this farmland looks like down here. <coughs> looks like some kind of a road. I don't, <coughs> I don't see any cars. I can let off the stick and then be dragged along by the plane. Chicago Center, KA 449er, 4,000 feet. KA 449er, Chicago Center, altimeter tree, 0 decimal, 1-4, continue as planned. 
some kind of civilization over here. Let's see what this is all about. <coughs> Love the way the water looks. I don't know if this is realistic or not. I see all these houses, so maybe so. Maybe this is their little, I don't know what you would call this, kind of a walk waterway, but anyway, <coughs> you can see houses with little boating docks and things, so that looks like a lot of fun. It does seem like it's a little out in the middle of nowhere. Um, nothing wrong with that, really. I'm just kind of wondering where does the water come from? K-449er contact, Des Moines approach on 123 decimal niner. One two three decimal niner for KA four four niner. Des Moines approach KA four four niner four thousand feet. Four thousand feet. Alright, having some fun with the drone there. Let me reset that. Woo, that could make you seasick. <coughs> Always try to plug my Xbox controller into the power supply and keep it from powering off. So the weather's gotten worse, it's gotten hazy. Uh, let's see, go back to external view. There we go. Very hazy day. I don't know what the temperature's like. It's probably warmish. I could look at the temperature gauge here. 48 degrees. Yeah, it's probably warmish at 4,000 feet.
Okay, so I'm going to begin descending to 3,000 feet. And I'm going to dethrottle. Keep from going too fast. So I'm going to try to slow down and lose some altitude at the same time here. Down to about, I guess that's thirty percent. We'll be landing shortly, so we need to burn off some of the speed and altitude. Okay, the barometer was off quite a bit, so that affected our apparent altitude. Okay, we can actually put the flaps down partway now. That will help it to slow down. Alright, there's that view. Okay, I'm happy with the slowish speed we're going, approaching the airport. I'm always running too hot, I think, so this seems really good. I'm going to reset the view, and then I'm going to take over for autopilot. The air must be really calm, because I didn't have to really do much once I took over. Well, I do have control over the plane. It felt like I didn't because I wasn't needing to do anything, I guess, but I definitely have control. Okay, I don't want to lose too much altitude yet. We're about the level where the landing pattern will want us to enter. going to keep the airport in view above the dashboard. Something very peaceful about this.
I never use the rudder for minor heading corrections. I don't know if you're supposed to. It feels like the rudder makes things unstable, so I don't tend to use it except on the ground. Okay, we gained a little bit of altitude. That's okay. We're still going at a good speed. Getting very close to the airport. Not much to do at this point except just keep everything moving forward safely at a good speed. I think I can actually see the airport now, just barely. See if I can lose a little bit of this altitude. Maybe drop throttle just a tad. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put the landing gear down in anticipation of landing. And I'm going to put the flaps down all the way and push on the stick and give it some throttle. Get our speed down to a safe range. Des Moines approach KA-449er. Request clearance to transition Charlie airspace. KA-449er, Des Moines approach. Clear through the Charlie airspace. Cleared through Charlie airspace KA-449er. Okay, I'm giving just a little bit more throttle. We're dropping speed more than I'm comfortable with. Des Moines Tower KA 449er is 1 1 miles east, 2,600 feet with whiskey to land. KA 449er Des Moines Tower. Altimeter 30 decimal 21206 at 7. Make straight in runway 23. Fly straight in runway 23 KA 449er. Alright. Bit more throttle. Just to get us up there. Endeavor 5220, follow the generic on final. 
on the slow side. I'm running the engines about as hot as I can. I think it's just because I need it to climb a little bit. I might be flying into a wind also. Getting some speed now. Having to push on the stick to keep from going any further or higher. We're going to turn and start our descent, and then I'm going to pull back on the throttle. Okay, I'm going to begin throttling back. I'm going to stick to the right side a bit, try to keep the runway visually centered. KV 449 or 1204 at 7. Clear to land runway 23. Alright, we've got landing clearance. Clear to land runway 23, KA 449 Our speed is good. I want to gradually go a little slower as we get closer. I want to learn how to use ILS. I've watched a tutorial or two on it. I need to watch it a couple more times and give it a try sometime. I think it would help with situations like this. I'm still just trying to master the basics, get the feeling of flying embedded in my brain and then I will get into more detailed things. Autopilot is probably about the most detailed thing I get into. Okay, I was trying to go a little fast. I'm going to pull back on the throttle, maybe about 40% or something. Runway doesn't feel visually centered, so I'm going to move over just a little. Okay. I'm going to pull back a little bit more on the throttle. I'd like to try to get us down closer to 100 without it being unsafe, so I'm going to continue pulling back. Just get over towards the left a little bit. Okay, drop the throttle some more. Try to get down to closer to 100. Okay, I got the throttle all the way down. Let's see if we can glide in. Okay, on this. So far, it feels comfortable. 
feels like a nice, comfortable, long runway. So let's just try to get centered a little better. Try to hover as long as possible. Okay, there's the rear wheel, front wheel, and brakes. Let's make a quick turn right here. Come to a stop. Parking brake flaps up. I should probably turn taxi lights off. I never think about. I mean, on. I mean, never think about lights. Okay. Just look around outside for a moment. Oh, the controller turned off, so I'll use the trackball. Okay, so they want us to contact Ryan. And we want taxi to parking. Des Moines ground, KA 449er taxi to parking. KA-449er taxi to General Aviation parking by taxiway Alpha Cross Runway 31 Alpha Cross Runway 23 Cross Runway 31 Cross Runway 23 Alpha. Taxiing to General Aviation parking by taxiway Alpha Cross Runway 31 Alpha Cross Runway 23 Cross Runway 31 Cross Runway 23 Alpha KA-449er. And then come back when I could just go left. Okay, well I'm gonna go left. Cause that seems a little... A little silly. I'll just use differential braking that out of pivot us up, pivot us around a little bit. Okay. Yep, that worked. Need to stop and let the traffic go by. Yeah, I can't have the bus because of See if I can pivot around as a bus. Jets. Might have been my fault by going the wrong way. Out of sequence. It seemed silly though when I could just make a slight left turn rather than make a big loop. Alright, let's see if I can make this nice and smooth. Okay. 
Okay, we are parked. Parking brake on. Engines off. Take around, take a little bit of a look outside. I was gonna turn the Xbox controller on, but sometimes the game locks up when you do that, so I don't wanna do that. Alright, so here we are in Des Moines. Um, interesting. It's nice to fly over. Let's go back inside and turn off the plane. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.